Welcome back, roadies. This is the fifth video in the Latrax mod series. If you've been following along, we just put in new shocks and shock towers. And now we're gonna custom paint a body shell. If you're interested in the part numbers and ordering these colors of paint, there they are. I did not use the Pearl White Blanco by Patrick. There's the clear body and the stickers that come with it. All the items we'll need to complete this project. Make sure you wash the body and get all the oils and fingerprints and dust and all kinds of contaminants that will mess your paint job up. I like to clean it up and make sure there's nothing in there that's going to mess with the paint. I like to use a broad, basic Sharpie. Just go over the body lines. I'm not doing anything fancy or custom. We're just tracing over the body lines so we can see them on the other side when we use the tape. Just take your time, be patient, relax. This isn't the kind of thing you do in a big hurry. You just want to make sure that you can see it on the other side when you apply the tape and use the razor blades. Once again, we're just tracing over the body lines. And there are the body lines completed. Get the masking tape, completely cover the area, and now you can see the body lines we just drew very easily. Trace them with the razor blade and pull away the tape. Make sure the edges are down tight. Continue doing this for all of the areas that we have marked. I pushed down really hard here, but the paint still got around the masking tape. Check it out. And boom. This thing looks great. Get the masking tape off. We got clear windows. Oh yeah, looking good. Now all we got left is to pull off the plastic. Well, here we go. I find this to be the most exhilarating part of the whole process. Pulling the plastic off, seeing what it really looks like. There's quite a bit of enjoyment that goes into painting your own body, and this is definitely the moment of enjoyment. Well, there it is. It looks really good. The paint turned out great. The windows turned out great. The bumpers look good, the little side panels. Not too big on many of those stickers, but I did put the headlights and the tail lights on. The white looks really good with the blue undercarriage. This thing looks so good. I, I am blown away. I love the white, especially with the chrome wheels. I really hope you're enjoying this mod series. In the next video, I'll be taking the car out for a spin. We'll see how she handles. If you've enjoyed this series so far, be sure and hit like and subscribe. 